Well, the decision to cancel the annual Martin Luther King Jr. Day Parade in Baltimore in lieu of a day of service was met with a lot of backlash and criticism. It's causing tension between the mayor's office and the city's Office of Promotion and the Arts. Late last night, though, the mayor tweeted that the parade will be happening on January 16th. WMAR 2 News' Nordea Lewis is live in downtown Baltimore with more on this story. Good morning, Nordea. That's right. Good morning. I think it's safe to say that people should prepare their walking shoes because yes, the MLK Day Parade is back in full swing. Now, the decision came with a lot of back and forth. Just days ago, the city announced Baltimore will be celebrating MLK Day through a day of service rather than a parade. But many people disagreed, specifically Councilman Eric Costello, who stated that the Baltimore Office of Promotion and the Arts cancellation of the parade leaves them in violation of their contractual agreement with Baltimore City. And many people agreed. Neighbors took to social media saying how much Baltimore needs a parade to honor the black community and to encourage the black youth to live up to what leaders like MLK fought for. It's been unanimous support for having the parade. I think um, there's disappointment with Boba's justification. Well, the cries were heard and Mayor Scott says MLK Day will be celebrated with the parade beginning at noon at the intersection of Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard and Utah Street. Now we're still waiting to see if the Office of Promotion and Arts will release a statement responding to Mayor Brandon Scott's announcement. Live in downtown Baltimore, Nordea Lewis, WMAR 2 News. All right, Nordea, thank you. Taking